Hi folks, Dr. David Perlmutter here. Welcome to The Empowering Neurologist. You know, clearly we've had a lot of discussions, a lot of guests here on the program talking about the ketogenic diet. In other words, powering the body uh, with fat as opposed to carbohydrates. And we have certainly covered the brain benefits of being in ketosis as well. And a lot of people have asked, where well, are there are there any uh, clinical studies that actually show improvement in a particular neurological problem uh, when people are placed on a ketogenic diet. And as a matter of fact, those studies are few and far between. But there was one study done many years ago that actually instituted a very ketogenic diet in five patients who were suffering from Parkinson's disease and noted some very significant changes. Let's just jump right to the studies. So let's take a look at the study. The study is entitled Treatment of Parkinson Disease with Diet-Induced Hyperketonemia Feasibility Study. And right off the bat, the notion of treating Parkinson's disease with any diet uh, is certainly uh, exciting, in this case, by increasing ketones. The study published way back in 2005 in the highly respected journal Neurology. That's the Journal of the American uh, Academy of Neurology. We know that there is a defect in the way brain cells make energy in Parkinson's and ketones are able to bypass that defect. Just five uh, patients, uh, a dietitian determined whether they were adherent to the uh, diet or not, and also evaluated their serum ketone levels. They went, uh, underwent what's called the UPDRS study. That is the Unified Parkinson's Disease Rating Scale that looks at mentation and mood. ADLs, activities of daily living, motor function and treatment complications, and comes up with a, a total. And when we look at the activities of daily living, uh, you know, self-care, etc., in yellow is before the uh, dietary intervention, and in blue is after. These are the five patients. A dramatic improvement brought on by uh, the ketogenic diet. Let's look at motor function. Uh, before and after going into ketosis. And again, really across the board, some pretty dramatic improvements. Uh, lower scores on the UPDRS means improvement. And let's look at the total UPDRS uh, across the board. Dramatic changes when you look at the percentage decrease in the, uh, the UPDRS demonstrating better functionality. Pretty profound uh, findings in terms of what this ketogenic diet was able to do, really uh, better than across the board than anything pharmaceutical that's available right now. Well, this was an interesting report, isn't it? Showing dramatic improvement in the uh, various parameters of the unified Parkinson's disease rating scale by simply going on a ketogenic diet. And again, this was a long, long time ago. Uh, when the study was published, I really am hopeful that more researchers will want to try uh, using a ketogenic diet in neurological problems. Uh, we understand why ketones are so beneficial for the brain and hope to see more of this research. In the meanwhile, I, I think we have to continue to understand what the basic science and the animal research is telling us and try to leverage that information in terms of recommendations for all of us. So, interesting information. Thanks for joining us. I'm Dr. David Perlmutter.